Harvey, what can I do for you? There's a Jeff Malone waiting in the conference room wanting to see both of us. Any idea who he is? I've run into him before. He's a hotshot at the SEC. What do you think he wants? Let's go find out. Miss Pierce, you must be Harvey Specter. I'm Jeff Malone. I know who you are. My question is, why are you here? You seem hostile. You investigate publicly traded companies. We're not publicly traded. No, but your clients are. Hence his question and our hostility. Our? We tend to stick together when an uninvited guest interrupts our dinner. Well, I didn't bring any wine, but uh, when I go, I hope you'll be happy that I dropped by. Yeah, I doubt that. So why don't you tell us which client you're here for and be on your way? All of them. Since when does the SEC go around intimidating law firms by going after their clients? They don't, but they will when Eric Woodall starts there next week. He comes at our clients after what he did? This time, he won't get fired. He'll end up in jail. Except it won't be Woodall who's coming. It'll be him. Exactly. Listen, I'm going to be getting a vaguely worded assignment with a not-so-vague agenda of getting up your client's asses with the full power of the SEC. And when they ask why, and they always ask why, I'm going to be expected to tell them that it's because they're clients of your firm. Why are you telling us this? Because he doesn't want to work for Woodall. He wants to work here. I've always heard how good you were. It's nice to see it's true. Anyway, here's the thing. I'm really tired of being a public servant. And more importantly, I've always thought that Eric Woodall was a, um... Ah, shit, I'll just go ahead and say it. He's a dick. Finally, something we can agree on. Seems to me the only thing left for us to agree on, Harvey, is my starting salary. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm sure all your new senior partners get paid the same. Before you start picking out floor patterns for your new office, I'd like to discuss this with my partner first. I'd expect nothing less. Oh, uh, just one more thing. I haven't been formally given this assignment yet, so I have no conflict. But in one more week I will, which means this offer will be gone. Is that a threat? I would never threaten someone that I want to be in business with, Jessica. It's just the truth. I like him. How did it go with Harvey? Didn't. What do you mean, it didn't? You're the only man here who can take on Jeff Malone. How could he not see that? I didn't bring it up. Lewis, winter is coming. I know, and I'm the night's watch. But right now, we need to be patient. Patience is not your strong suit. Well, today it is. Because if there's one thing that I've always known is that you do not call the pretty girl. You wait for her to call you. Lewis, I'm seeing someone. I'm happy for you. Though I have no idea why you're saying that right now. Katrina, trust me. They're going to find out about Jeff Malone soon enough. Because he's going to come calling. And when he does, they're going to come right over to me. Like him all you want. I'm not hiring him. Why not? Why do you think? Because you don't like making decisions staring down the barrel of a shotgun. Jessica Pearson, nice to meet you. Jessica, the man walked in here and offered to fight for us. If it's not him, who's it going to be? The guy in the office next door. Lewis? Harvey, Lewis knows everything there is to know about the SEC. He's damn good, and you know it. This guy isn't damn good. He's a killer. And he's a prosecutor. We need a defender. If I'm in a dark alley, I'd take the killer over to the defender seven days a week, and Eric Woodall's going to put us in a dark alley. Lewis is a known quantity, and right now, Jeff Malone's biggest selling point is telling us that Woodall is coming. Lewis sure as hell didn't, which means he either didn't know or he wasn't man enough to come in here and take the job for himself. Harvey, do you know why I don't like being strong-armed into decisions? Because I'll never be able to trust the person who did it. Then figure out a way to get someone as good, or hire this guy and come to terms with it. Because if it's Lewis against Malone in a street fight, I'm picking that dude. 